Hello, I'm Father James Kubicki, a Jesuit priest and the National Director of the Apostleship of Prayer, which is the Pope's prayer network. Today is the Solemnity of the Most Sacred Heart of Jesus, a feast that's important to the Apostleship and to Jesuits, because since the 1600s, we have worked to promote this important devotion. It was a Jesuit, Saint Claude La Colombière, who was the spiritual director for Saint Margaret Mary, to whom Jesus revealed his heart on fire with love for humanity in the year 1673. It should be no surprise then that Pope Francis, who is a Jesuit, should have a deep devotion to the Sacred Heart of Jesus. It shows up in various ways. For example, in an address that he gave to the Ecclesial Congress for the Diocese of Rome in 2014, he said the following, referring to a passage in Matthew chapter 9, we must have Jesus' heart, who, when he saw the crowds, he had compassion for them because they were harassed and helpless like sheep without a shepherd. Seeing the crowds, he felt compassion. I like to dream of a church that lives the compassion of Jesus, a church that has a heart without boundaries, but not just the heart, also the look, the gentleness of the look of Jesus, which often is more eloquent than many words. What Pope Francis is saying here is that our devotion to the heart of Jesus should make our hearts more like his, open to others, to everyone, and especially to those who are suffering. And if our hearts are filled with the love that fills the heart of Jesus, then it will show on our faces. For what is in a person's heart is most clearly seen on their face.